Hello again, this is Dave Molinex, and uh, you're probably watching this video because you're part of my online Edpuzzle class. And we just finished adding actual classes to our Edpuzzle or, or showing how to do that. So the next step um, uh, might be to invite students. You don't necessarily have to do it now. You can do it in a later point. Um, but this is how you do it. So basically you would check your or select your class. So I've got Technology 201 selected. And then I can click right up here where it says invite your students. And when I do that, then I get this little code. So um, if I was going to use the code, I'd have it projected somewhere. Students would come in, they'd sign into edpuzzle.com as a student. And then on their screen, they'd have a little plus sign where they could join a class and they'd type in this code. I can also have uh, share this link, which is basically the same edpuzzle.com slash join and then the same uh, code and I can share that through my Google Classroom, Twitter, or through email. Now if you already added your class and it is a Google class then uh, one of the things you'll notice it says invite students but when I go into my Google class it says import students and so when I click on import students then I can see now, hopefully, yep, I've got Erin Marshall. She's uh, my only member at this point. I will have some more. Um, but it's that simple to add the students. If you have any questions on uh, any of this, then you can just send me an email through our Google Classroom.